discuss dating a little bit when Nia Jax stopped by and she didn't seem into dating another WWE superstar at all. Nikki said that some people slid into her DMs when she became single, but right now it's not the time. Nia asked her if she was dating another wrestler and Nikki gave a big no to that. It seems like any guys in the WWE who are interested in Nikki Bella will have to find another girl to hit on the DMs. Because Nikki Bella is done dating WWE superstars. This might be a good decision in the long run. After all, even though Nikki isn't around WWE much anymore, it's never a good idea to date people you work with because it can always result in awkwardness later on. You don't think the media is gonna blow it out of proportion and make up all this B. S. Yeah, the media is crazy. Brie tells her sister which appears to calm her down a bit. Nikki tells Brie that she considers Artem to be one of her close friends and that she really wants to do this. It just sucks because I'm in a situation where I feel like everyone's constantly telling me how to live my life, Nikki says. Unfortunately, that's the position we're in, Brie states as a matter of fact. Nikki and Artem did spark romance rumors recently but it had a lot to do with a beaming Nikki on a date with him than anything else. In the last episode, the two meet in town for a lunch date and their chemistry is unmistakable, to say the least.